All right, today we're going to be making our famous Texas Italian meatballs. So we're gonna be using these ingredients right here, some spices, an egg, <laughs> and some water. First things first, put the oven on 400 degrees. Don't forget to start it, sometimes I forget. All right, so the first ingredient we're gonna put into the bowl is our organic ground beef. This is about 1.34 pounds. I'll throw it in there. Yeah, and the reason why we buy these instead of the big bulk pa package at Costco is it's just easier to freeze mm -hmm. these little packages and pull them out as we need them. We buy this sausage, it has seasoning in it, less than one gram of carb, and it has zero sugars. We like this one because it's seasoned hot. It is not that hot, it just adds a little bit of a kick, mm -hmm. which we like in our Italian meatballs, so that's why we use it. And this is one pound of spicy sausage. All right, so now we're gonna use my favorite tool from Gorilla Grip. I think it's a potato masher, but I use it to do the meat. Originally I was using my hands, which is fine and it works well, but when the meat's really cold, it makes my hands freeze up, so I like using this in the beginning just to get the initial mix in. I'll use my hands later. All right, next we're doing a fourth a cup of water. All right, and then we just added one egg. Next is a half a cup of mozzarella cheese. All right, and we have a mixture of a half a teaspoon of pepper, a half a teaspoon of salt, a tablespoon of Italian seasoning, a tablespoon of garlic, and a tablespoon of onion powder. We're just gonna mix that up. Hey, nasty boy. Hey, you want some meatballs? Do you want a meatball? Do you want a meatball? You're a carnivore too, huh? You a carnivore? Nay, me. Are you a carnivore? Nash, only shake if you're a carnivore. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you carnivore, but your hands are bowing. All right, so I took my rings off and now I'm going to put some olive oil on this boiled pan. This helps prevent the meatballs from sticking. What I also do is I put some olive oil on my clean hands that are just washed. This helps the meat from sticking to my hands while I roll. So I just get a good amount about that size and put them on down. Just wanted to note, I've been working out. Serena <laughs> went up 20 pounds in, in weight on squat today. And I went 30 pounds in our squat. Congratulations, Mrs. Carnivore. Thank you, Mr. Carnivore. Getting strong. Yeah, buddy. I believe that it's from the carnivore diet. Definitely getting strength quicker and quicker. And I'm continuously seeing results. So very thankful for this diet. All right, we're gonna throw these in the oven for 25 minutes. Time to eat. Mm, that's the smell of America right there. And that's the smell of freedom right there. <laughs> yes, sir. You look good. So this is it. And if you want extra cheese, you can put a little bit of mozz on top. Yep, and that's Voila. it. Voila! So actually, one of my wife's ultimatums with going on the carnivore diet was that she had to have at least one Italian dish. So I found this recipe. She tweaked it and made it to where she can eat it. She loves Italian food. This fulfills her craving of that Italian food that she desires so much. So me, I'm, I'm fine with my steak and eggs, but she loves her Italian. All right, we had to get a box so that we could put the camera on top of it because Greg's too tall and I'm too short. But we just wanted to acknowledge all of our subscribers that we have. We have 43 right now. We're so excited to have you guys along with us on our journey. Thank you guys for the support. We're excited. We also wanna know what kind of videos you guys want to see. So go ahead and leave comments down below if you have any specific videos you want us to film. We just wanna be able to make videos that you guys will want to watch. We don't wanna make videos that no one's gonna watch, so yeah. Yeah, and yeah. 
<laughs> you know the drill? If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Hit the notification bell up above if you want to be reminded every time we upload a new video. I'll see you in our next one. Thank y'all. Peace. Bye.